Hi everyone, this is Ipeli. In this video, we'll be talking about the technique, tuning and scoldatura. For a bassist, tuning is quite flexible. The 4-string bass is often fitted with an extension and a lower C string that can do down to C or sometimes to B. It is up to bassists to play with fingers or to use mechanical levers on the extension during the performance. For a solo bassist, the tuning is changed to A, E, B, F sharp from high to low strings for a brighter sound. There is also a 5 string bass where E string is added as a lower string, or occasionally a C string is added as the highest string. Compared to the 4 string bass, the 5 string bass is less popular. There are two kinds of notation for the bass standard orchestra tuning or solo tuning. However, it is better to notate in standard orchestra tuning, as solo tuning is written at a transposed pitch, meaning to notate the finger position as if played in regular tuning. This technique is called scodatura. For a cellist, we don't usually change the tuning of the open strings. We may tune the A string down to G, like Johann Sebastian Bach's fifth solo suite suggests, or tune the C and G strings down to B and F sharp. When playing Hungarian composer Kodai's cello solo sonata, to notate this the strings that need to tune down at the beginning of the piece and write at a transposed pitch. Take the chords D A F sharp D for example. When playing the D major chord on a standard tuning cello, I use the fingering 1, 1, 3, 4. With this cello tuning to B, F sharp, D, A, I use the, I use the fingering 2, 2, 3, 4. And I read the E flat, B flat, F sharp, D in the score. Scodatura brings out different timbre and resonance. However, change the tuning during the performance or at a quiet passage is not ideal. We also prefer lower and raise the pitch of the string. Make sure there is sufficient time for tuning and do not retune more than at home during the performance. <laughs>